Hello everyone, we just got a new cutscene with the Seeds of Renewal 10.2.5 update here for World of Warcraft Dragonflight, including a bunch of epilogues, and apparently we have a new cutscene, a new cinematic, and I'm excited to see it because it's Viranoth apparently coming to, uh, coming to have a meeting with a Riddicron. So let's go ahead, let's watch, let's see what, uh, what happens, shall we? I'm excited. I had received a missive from Eridacron. He wished to speak with me, and me alone. I am here. It seems your courage has not faltered, despite abandoning our war. Dude, I'm so that glad Eridacron is, is back. It's over, Eridacron. It was you who abandoned our cause, who abandoned Farak to his own destruction. All for some trinket Neltharion left behind. The Dark Heart is no mere trinket. Its power now lies in the Harbinger's hand. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. The Void cannot be trusted. I trust its hunger. You know the Titans infected our world. And I will see them extinguished. The question is, sister, will you? I will have no part of this. Hmm. Then the bond of the Incarnates is truly ended. See me again until the Titans face their reckoning. But to you, Viranath, I offer one final warning. Stay out of my way. Yo, a Riddicron is so cool. He's just. He's just so cool. Why is he so cool? Who made him that cool? I, I'm really excited. Obviously, we're going to be seeing a Riddicron pop back up in the, the last Titan, the final expansion of the World Soul Saga. Uh, it's probably the next time we're going to see him, honestly. Like, we, we might not see him at all until then. And I think that's kind of exciting because we'll definitely be seeing Zalatath. And now she has the Dark Heart, which is who knows and then because she's obviously you know the harbinger a Riddicron knows her he's using the void the same way the void is using him i am i think this is i think a Riddicron, honestly is one of the more uh interesting antagonists that we've seen blizzard do in a really long time and i'm really really glad uh that they're not just kind of removing him in dragonflight or whatever uh they're going to keep him around there's a lot of folks that they're kind of keeping around right now for a payoff later. And like, Farak was dope, but it makes sense for Farak to see his end now. But like, Denathrius is still kind of out there somewhere. Zalatath, Ajara, Eridicron, like those alone. And we have a rogues gallery in World of Warcraft that I am very excited to see the future of. Uh, that cinematic is dope. Viranoth is dope. I I think it's interesting that Viranoth is still being like, dude, I, I'm, I'm not... I won't have a part with this. Not even trying to negotiate with him, right? Just, just, she, she doesn't want to do it anymore. She's seen, she's seen that the, the other dragons aren't slaves to the Titans either. And I think that's really cool. I would have liked to see though, I would have liked to see her try to convince him. Like, hey, you're, you're right. But they are starting to see that too. Or at least... They're not slaves to the Titans like we thought they were. They were just unawares, right? I don't know. I'm excited to see, though. I'm, I'm excited. I'm real excited. Streaming, streaming this tomorrow, anyways. Okay, bye.